想时候，想求心里小小的邮票，我在卷轴，母亲在内轴。长大后，想求新疆窄,窄窄的船票，我在卷轴。新娘在内走，后来想求西方矮矮的房屋，我在外走，母亲在里走。我在街头，大路在里头。That was a poem written by an overseas Chinese, reflecting on his feelings towards his homeland. These feelings are captured by a postage stamp, by a ticket for his bride, for his mother's gravestone and then the ocean that fights him and his homeland. As a poem, it speaks very strongly to British Chinese. And I guess that leads to the question, why do we want to celebrate China National Day outside of China? Well, today there's two reasons, respect and responsibility. Respect for all that China has achieved in bringing a quarter of the world population out of poverty. Respect for China as investor and workshop in the world, in improving all our lives, no matter race, class, or religion. And respect from a British Chinese like myself and a British Chinese community for the positive impact Chinese achievements have made for all our lives. No longer are we only about takeaway shops and martial arts or just fortune cookies and cater for Pink Panther movies. These things are worth celebrating. However, with respect comes responsibility. Responsibility British Chinese in this country to show that through hard work, respect for others, that we can integrate better. A responsibility also for British Chinese to take advantage of that newfound respect and break the mode of traditional expectation, go into public life, media, politics. A responsibility for China, a nation top table, an opportunity for her to become a powerful facilitator for peace and prosperity. So happy birthday China. With this birthday I hope will bring with it a more active Chinese leadership on the world stage, balance with respect and responsibility. Together, we can make a better tomorrow. Thank you.